I thank the distinguished representative of the African Union, and I now give the floor to the distinguished representative of the International Federation for Family Development. Excellencies, distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen, the global pandemic crisis has shown the great value of new technologies, especially for families. New technologies have enabled many people to continue working at home. They have helped many teachers and parents to continue to provide an education for their children when the schools closed. They have provided ways to stay connected with friends and relatives. They have been a way to reach out for help getting food and medicines. They have been a much needed source of entertainment. At the same time, new technologies have shown a darker side. Parents around the world are concerned about what impact the internet is having on their children's lives. Their concern is not so much about if they're spending too long online, but more about their online interactions and impacting on their health, happiness, and well-being. They also worry about them being cyberbullied, what their kids' digital legacy will be, and if they are safe online. The International Federation for Family Development has been organizing various events regarding the impact of new technologies on parenting and families around the globe. Experts from our federation, the UN system, and academia have been focusing on how policymakers can deal with the right conditions for families to access the internet, how telework has contributed to work-family balance, the way to improve education from the remote learning experiences of COVID-19, which specific policies could help to bridge the intergenerational digital divide, what instruments should be developed to ban child abuse materials online, and finally, what is the best tool parents can use to prevent online abuse of their children? Thank you, Chair. I thank the representative of the International Federation for Family Development, and I now give the floor to the representative of the Asian Pacific Research.